Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new safe hour. We are jumping in again and this time we're going to go as little old chicken because chicken has slow-mo and I like it. It's very, very nice. Before, well, in the most recent version of Nuclear Throne, the actual real recent version, uh, instead you have the ability to throw your weapons, I think it is. Um, but in the older versions of Nuclear Throne, it was actually slow motion that this character had and I much, much, much prefer slow-mo to weapon throw. Uh, so I'm glad this version sticks with having slow-mo for this character. It's it's much better. A weapon throw just is very rarely useful, I think. Uh, you can make builds out of it that are kind of interesting, but yeah, this is more my style. We're going to speed through. We'll try and get ourselves some other, um, some other what they're called, um, melee weapons, like golden melee weapons, and try and play around with them. Uh, but yeah, we also have the, the, the thing where we can be a li literal headless chicken and make sure we prevent death as well, which is quite nice. Uh, let's take out all of these first. Good. And then we'll uh, fire some of those at you. Lovely. Keeping my grenade launched so we can go through. Hopefully we can get open mind here if it's available. There it is. So we can get two golden weapons. Always try and get that if I'm going to be going straight for golden weapons. It's way more worthwhile than anything else. And to be fair, I mean, I think open mind is something that I still underrate to this day. I'm not sure if um, you could throw an ultra does anything. Um, different with open mind and how it generates chests, but it feels better for some reason. Like, look at this. Getting two of those is, ooh, beautiful. More rads for me. Pizza time. Let's go. Um, shotgun, rifle, charge, shotgun, golden screwdriver. Beautiful. Stick with the, uh, the good old katana for now. I wonder if there's like an upgraded katana you can get. Because like I feel like this is the only version of the katana. Now let's not die. Okay, one minute, one minute, one minute. Gimme, gimme. Okay, good, good, good. Right, we're into uh into this area now. What should we go with? Second stomach is probably a good idea. Yeah, let's go with second stomach right now. We got the toxic, we got triple blood rifle. I'm gonna take that for now. Bit of protection. Right. Ah, bugger. Try and kill him before he does anything stupid to me. Okay, good. We got rid of him. The penetrator. Ah, penetrator's not particularly ideal for us right now. Do you know what? Take the SMG because it's just a little less ammo hungry. Where's the actual car? Where's the actual car? <laughs> I'm a little lost on a, a good old car. There, there it is. Why, why can it do that? It needs to not generate inside walls, man. <laughs> um, let's go with power craving. SMG definitely isn't the best weapons I have here. And I'm probably going to have some ammo issues. Okay, no melee weapons, unfortunately, but good enough. We'll take the golden glove. I mean, golden glove is technically melee, and we got it with whatever that is on it. I don't know what that is on it, to be honest. Yeah. The golden glove's actually a pretty, a pretty fun starting weapon. We'll sacrifice a mod to go through here. I don't really go this way this often. Um, hmm... Take Tough Shell just because we're going to be bashing into enemies here. Oh, bugger. Oh, I didn't I didn't think about the poison. Yeah, I didn't think about the poison, man. That's going to be problematic. Oh, my lord. There ain't no way I'm living in here. <laughs> I did not play this correctly at all. Now, Second Stomach might be pretty useful here for just making sure we stay alive. We'll see. Dude, this thing just won't die. Those big boys have some crazy health. Disc Eraser. Oh god, that sounds very dangerous. Jackhammer is something I've not really used before, but it is a melee weapon, so it might be kind of good for us. Hmm. Not super confident about this. Let me just get rid of that real quick. I mean, it does, it does destroy bullets, so... 
Yeah, this isn't this isn't really working, is it? This thing does like fuck all damage. Right, let me go. Let me go get my uh, my glove back. Glove was better. Right. Oh God, that's that's been a bit iffy. Um, the only intestine seems like it could be good with slow mo. I've not really been using the slow mo at all, have I? Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. <laughs> Again, weapons that. Don't really work for the scenario we're in. My current theory is just keep using um, the glove and hope we don't die. I mean, it's somehow somewhat working. <laughs> I'll be honest, I'm not entirely sure as to how. Shotgun lands. It's a melee weapon shotgun. I'll take it. Right. Then maybe go with long arm to like pair with this thing. See how that goes. Oh yeah, that's that's nice. That's nice. I like this. I like this a lot. Get this with shotgun shoulders as well. So this weapon will be like the ultimate version of this thing. Okay, we got bush boss. Oh come on, game. Don't be like this with me. Oh, dude, where did you two come from? No, no, no. Need healing. Okay, just about managed to keep that there. Oh, boy. Okay. Love Bubbler. I don't really know how the Love Bubbler works. Seems to be pretty decent, though. Kind of clears an entire room of enemies. Doesn't do a ton of damage to bosses by the looks of things, though. It's good enough, though. Stick with the shotgun lance here. What's all about nine already? I don't even know what the ultras are for this bad boy. Super bouncer flak. I will definitely take that over this. Right. We've now got a little bit of difference going on now. Um, Probably go with that. That's pretty fun. Super Bouncer Flacker. I like you. I can get down with that. Auto Splinter Spear Launcher. Nah, we gotta stick with this thing. <laughs> Look at that, that's amazing. I'm liking that, I'm liking that. Kind of fire in the hall and spread the shots everywhere. Hope for the best. Seems to be, the hoping for the best strategy seems to be working pretty damn well. And then this melee. I mean, long arms wasn't super necessary, but it's nice to have, isn't it? Just a little extra. We got inverted portal if we want to do inverted portal. That would be inverted throne as well. I think we'll take it. Why not? Take the risk. Yeah, I think, this, I think this should be pretty decent. I'm, I'm not super confident on Inverted Throne yet, but we'll give it the best shot we can. We'll definitely use this thing for a little while, I think. Oh, I always forget it goddamn does that. Holy fuck. I'm not even remotely ready for this. Okay, I've become headless already. So, okay, wait, I'm still headless. I, I swear... That HP right there, you see this bit of HP? I definitely picked that up and it was just like, no you didn't. No you didn't. Great, thanks for that. Anyways, let's uh, let's put on our golden fist. What's our B skin? So, acquire the black sword. Literally no idea what that means. Uh, the most powerful sword. Acquire the most powerful sword loop with chicken sword. I don't know what any of that means. That's incredibly vague. Okay, this thing is a very good starting weapon. I'm liking this. I'm liking this. Uh, impact wrist with this seems fun as well. Give that a go. Being able to literally blast enemies 
all around everywhere. Seems like carnage. Beautiful, beautiful chaos. We like beautiful chaos over here. We really do. Holy shit, wasn't expecting you. Yeah, I think second stomach and like maybe even, um, what's it called? Uh, strong. No, no, no. Um, Gamagus is the one. Gamagus would be really good. That's the other one I'm thinking of. Open mind again because we're going down here once again. Get even more golden weapons and locks. Stuff. Ooh, hello. What melee weapon might you be, perchance? I will take that, the club. See what's going on down here. Cool. We're good. Nope. Let me pass that. Boom. Down we go. Pizza time. Um... Sodium Hunger is normally pretty good. Heavy Sledgehammer. Oh, there's, there's still a turtle back here. Yeah, I'll stick with a Heavy Sledgehammer, try that out. Um... Okay. Like a car's over there. Unfortunately, I have taken quite a bit of damage. Nah, don't do it to me, don't do it to me. You, you know there's no need to do this. Okay, I managed to survive. Okay, I need to take this over heavy, I guess. Bye, boss. Don't want anything to do with you. Um, got puffy cheeks, maybe? Beautiful stuff. We're just de decimating areas here. I need my full HP again. I can't remember how you actually get your full HP. Is it by getting like a medic chest or something? Okay, we've got a good amount of golden weapons going on here now. We've got an inverted it as well. Inverted portal like that. Tough shell. I think Tough Shell is something I should be taking more often as well, to be honest. Dude, I got so many golden weapons here, that was awesome. Very nice. That's the way to do it. Open mind inverted. Um, I died again? I died again? What's going on? Yeah, I'm dead. I don't even know what happened there. The, the fist is very, very risky, to be honest. Right, well, let's, let's go back to um, chicken and put on random the golden weapon this time, because we've got so many available. Might as well take a random. I think we've got golden director's shotgun here, which seems pretty goddamn good. Like, golden shotgun alone is pretty good. Golden director's very nice. It's like having built-in eagle eyes. Good, good. Are we going to go for more golden weapons? I mean, we kind of might as well. And I could take Eagle Eyes. I'm going to take Trigger Fingers, though. I don't take Trigger Fingers enough, either. I, th I think if I'm going to do melee, Trigger Fingers is a necessity. Um, and this character leans itself towards melee, so I might as well. Cool. Screwdriver. I mean, actually better off taking the screwdriver, because then I don't have to take the cursed one. I still need an explosive weapon. Boy. Nice and easy. Kind of stomping through here. Yeah, let's take that. I mean, we might as well build into this for right now. It seems like fun to start with. Just kind of walked right into those shots. Easy. Oh, beautiful. This is great. 
And the ammo's not even a problem either. Because we don't have an explosive weapon right now, so... We're not going there yet. Or at least we're not going through pizza sewers. We can get there other ways, but... That's been the main way so far. Right, what weapon we got here? Explosive, maybe? No, bullet shotgun. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. We still got our screwdriver ready. Um, plutonium hunger, I think. Absolutely covering the place in shots at the minute. Beautiful. Gotta be careful I don't accidentally destroy the one true car. Those cars can go. There it is. Go. Unfortunately, we don't have open mind this time, so we're not going to get as ludicrously good stuff as last time, but... We get the blood rifle. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, this has been, this has been pretty good. Level up again. There you go. Right, give us a uh, give us second stomach again. I was liking having that. Gamma guts has been pretty good as well, but Rhino skin for the extra maximum HP is super useful on this character. Okay. I'm surprised that ammo situation has been like so fine. We've not really come close to running out of ammo yet, considering we're just spamming the ever living shit out of this thing. I really hate it when these sniper guys get behind the boss. It feels really cheesy. Oh, really? Sleeping Beauty there. Yeah. Not too bad on that guy. Good, good. Okay, level 6 as well. We're kind of plowing through. I think at this point we can probably take impact risks pretty safely. Whoa, what's going on with all these? Whoa. Like too many of them in one spot or something. Okay, our weapons definitely at this point fallen off pretty heavily. Okay. Yeah, we definitely need something better for uh for this boss. That works. Oh no, it doesn't. Okay, well I've killed myself immediately. Bouncer Bazooka. Not... Not the weapon I was expecting to see there. Not ideal at all. Do have a toxic pistol here, which is pretty strong, but a little bit deadly. I wish the goddamn poison didn't linger so long. Get out of here, poison. Not a great first stage when you don't level up. What I want to really do is, like, just spam the hell out of this thing while keeping my distance. It's not always that plausible, and you kind of run the risk of run missing out on quite a few rads. Oh, dude. Oh, doing that and accidentally hitting a wall right next to you and destroying yourself. Okay, nice and easy. Big old level two. Um, normal movement speed and normal fire rate during slow motion. That seems pretty good. How long can I hold slow motion for? Don't tell me this is just infinite. Because if it is, the but on this guy is insanely good. Yeah, I think I can just hold this indefinitely. Man, get this with Euphoria. Be pretty goddamn good. Easy. Man. Yeah, this is good. <laughs> okay, throwing butt on this guy is very good. 
Right, um... Du, 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 du. Impact Risk is just too good to not take. Honestly, it is. It's so much fun. Burr, I'll take a burr. Ooh, that was a very quick stage. Wow. Right, who we got over here? Nice, I can like charge up my burr now and like prepare myself because of the slow-mo. I really want to get euphoria with this just to see how slow the enemy bullets really are. Boom. I see you up there. Oh, slashy boy. Get out of here. Okay, good. Yeah, I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. Um, rabbit's paw, maybe. Makes it a lot easier to manage weaving between things. Assault shotgun sounds good as our secondary. I'm not, I want this with Herming is what I want. Oh, I missed out on that HP. I probably still could have got that in time, actually. Through here we go. Gonna go straight through right now, I think. Okay. I don't need to fully charge for most basic enemies, to be honest. The fully charging's more for the piercing than anything, really. Okay, I'm gonna try and clear out some of that. Yeah, assault shotgun, pretty helpful. Bullying the hell out of this guy. There you go. Good shit. Good old wrench. I don't think I need a wrench. Come on, Euphoria, where are you? I'll go with trigger fingers for now. Yeah, nothing that way. Only 25 at max charge, though. It's not not a ton. That's the way we want to be doing those guys. Oh my god, I love, love this area when you've got what's it called? All the knockback. Just decimates the entire area. It's beautiful. Right, stay out the middle, remember. Damage is fine. Would have thought he'd be dead by now. There you go. He died eventually. Go with lightning screwdriver as a secondary right now. Damn, no euphoria. Okay, lightning screwdriver has unlimited ammo. I thought it would be like energy screwdriver where it would cost. So lightning screwdriver might be pretty good for us here. Flame Splinter Gun, I like that. Wow, I like that a lot. <laughs> that is very good. God damn, that's beautiful to watch. Lights everything on fire, and then obviously it's not on top of that, it is a Splinter Gun too, so... Careful. You can probably get a few of these through the wall. The lightning's very beautiful here. Not a big fan of everything being grayscale because of, uh... Didn't know that could happen with the sheath. Being grayscale sort of a little bit because we're, uh, holding down the slow-mo, but it's just so worthwhile. Frost flare gun. Okay. 
God damn, this was beautiful. Kind of want Herming now. Um, where else are we meant to be going here? Oh, the portal's just over there, I see. No euphoria. How dare you, game? Thick, scarier face than I guess. Very, very bad damage on me there. Okay. Oh, I forgot about you. You, my guy, should be pretty solvable with this thing. I don't know how much health you actually have. I think it's only 100. Or it's maybe like 150 or something. It's not a lot. Excuse me, dickhead. Blood bubbler. I'll take the blood bubbler. I like the bubbler weapons. They're pretty strong. Right, again, get in here with the swingies. Oh my lord, look at this little area. I need to be taking open mind way more often. It's amazing. And that was a quick, quick, quick clear of this area. Apart from... Why is there always one? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Beautiful stuff. I want to see how this bubbler works. I mean, blood bubbler as well. Seems like it's going to be really good because like destroys shots and stuff because it's blood based. I mean, we had that like hyper blood launcher the other episode that was just absolutely nuts. So I respect blood more now. I have died, but don't worry. I will, I was going to say, I will come back to life. I knew it to be true. You're staying too far away for me to hit with either weapon that I currently have, so that's fun. Okay, this thing does legitimately no damage, so maybe maybe I, I was a bit misinformed with this bad boy. Okay, there you go. We got a blood launcher. That's more like it. Right. Rhino skins to regain some of that max HP. Get out of here, you. Yeah, this thing eats up ammo, but it's it's pretty good. It's killing at high speeds. But yeah, the ammo, goddamn, the ammo situation is not good with it, though. Inverted there. We got a Kraken launcher, I think that was. Kraken launcher versus blood launcher shotgun. Kraken Launcher is probably a little better for us. I'm not particularly enthused by this area being inverted. I'm not super attuned to what that means for us. Stay away from me. Got a swarm on this, I guess. Director Box Gun. Give that a go, why not? We're level 9 again here. Okay. We all good? We are all good. Have we been through here before already? Are we getting a choice here? Second stomach is one that we wanted, so I'll just take that. Um, we'll go with Splinter on this as well. We've got Swarm and Splinter on this bad boy now. Septuple Short Pop Gun. Plasma Quake. Oh my god. Plasma Quake is certainly looking good. I'm going to take the box gun for now, though. Right, let's try this out. Remember to stay off to the side here. We're probably going to die again here because this, this boss is just tough. Okay. That was a very quick kill. A little bit unexpected. We got our ultra as well. Kills extend bleed time is always useful. More melee damage is decent. Slow mo is much more efficient on enemy projectiles. Even more effective with Euphoria. Slow motion completely stops your projectiles. Why would I want it to stop my projectiles? When in slow mo, you vanish and drop a decoy. When vanished, enemies won't target you. Yeah, let's, let's do that. Nice one. Holy shit, that hit me. <laughs> I 
I'm liking this whole enemies not targeting me idea. Kraken Ion Cannon. Okay, that's pretty cool, but not quite as good as just the launcher. The straight-up launcher seems more convenient to use. I'm liking the cube gun as well. That's pretty fun. But yeah, for, for big areas, this thing seems more than ideal. Hyper Assault Slugger. Decided to go underwater for a little bit here, because why not? Oh my god, the rads. The rads, baby. Okay, beautiful. Apparently got one other enemy over here. Cuba will take care of you. Wondering what our next big weapon's going to end up being. So right now, this thing's just absolutely carrying us. I mean, Kraken is so goddamn strong. we got second stomach as well. That's good stuff. Boss time. Ah, shit. I almost killed myself then because I didn't want to be too close to the car. I don't even know where the boss is right now, so... I'm just kind of pretending it doesn't exist. There it is. Good, good. Got there in the end. Termite Injector. Seems pretty interesting. Hyper Slugger. Oh! Oh, I like that. <laughs> That's really cool. Okay. Heavy double shotgun. Seems pretty goddamn amazing as well. I'm going to stick with these two, I think. Good, good. You're gone. Heavy double shotgun seems like it'll just be... A really, really good weapon for, like, doing a lot of damage to bosses. Laser bomb launcher. Got a lot of launchers of various varieties. I like the fact that the launchers are more viable in this mod. I feel like in, in the original, launchers don't really see the light of day much in the late game. Is that not it? Who's left? Well, there's an area somewhere we clearly haven't been in. I like our little cool guy shades chicken boy here. Okay. Just you two little fools chilling back here. Careful of my HP. I'm, I'm letting it get away from me too easily at the minute. Just because I have second stomach doesn't mean I can be super loosey-goosey. Means I can be a bit loosey-goosey, not super loosey-goosey. Right, in we go. I will take shotgun on that bad boy. And then I will take... No, I didn't mean to exit. I meant to take a crown. I forgot that's not how you take crowns anymore. Well, we'll get it at some point later. Nice. Yeah, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to take a crown. Okay. Just fire off a few shots here. That used up all my ammo there, but I think it was worth. How did none of those shots hit you? There you go. Okay, that was a little tricky, but we got there. Hmm. 
more. It's getting to the point where it's actually more about ammo than anything else right now. Okay, this time don't go through that pole. That'd be stupid. Can I can I have that weapon that's bouncing around like crazy, please? Cool, I got it. I'm gonna crack into it as well. Seems fun. Right. First of all, go through to this bit because we've probably got some rewards we can grab. This is not the room that I was expecting to go to. Oops. Wait, what? Where's the Oh, it's here, okay. Wait, what? No, it is here. Okay. Yeah. Max HP. Just got the one so far. It's fine, we'll take that. And then we'll go with crowns. And we'll, of course, take the one that we always take. Um, which is, which one? This one. This is, this is cool. <laughs> this is a good way to fight this guy. Plasma balls everywhere. I liked it. I'm liking it a lot. Okay, careful of ammo. Ammo situation's getting a bit bleak. It's the thing, we've got to make sure we get in there to retrieve all the ammo from all the things that we kill. Can't just leave it. I like that. Yeah. This little corner of chaos over here. I got very hurt by something, but I'm not entirely sure what. Explosive screwdriver sounds dangerous. Okay. We is through. Yeah, once the enemies have more HP like this, it's actually the ammo situation is getting a lot more concerning. It's taking like two shots to kill some of these guys. On the early stages, we're just decimating everything. It's not a problem at all. Yeah. Crack an ion cannon again there. More golden weapons, good, good. I don't think I want to go to the courtyard yet. Rusty revolver. Stick with the crown I've got, please. We got here fire chain gun and a hyper machine gun. Oh, what the fuck is that? Amazing. Bouncer Plasma Cannon, though, has been kind of interesting. Fire Chain Gun seems very cool. I'm going to try the Fire Chain Gun. It seems more interesting to me. Hello, boss man. How are you this fine day? Yeah, that's it's good. <laughs> it's good. It's most certainly good. Basically, if the enemy's on top of the chain, they just take constant damage. Nice. Beautiful. Oh, we got our little YV buddy with us here as well. Hello, friend. This thing with their uh, homing on it could be amazing. Oh my god. I forgot I had trigger fingers. <laughs> this is nuts. Thunder Kraken. Nah, Kraken Launcher is better, apparently. Um... I guess strong spirit, just in case. <laughs> I 
liking this a lot. What on earth is this portal? Oh, there's just one of the thingy areas. I get it. Okay, I think I'm about to die here. What's, what's this guy firing? Yeah, the fire chains are pretty wicked. One of the cooler weapons I've seen, I think. Only thing is, it's a little bit ammo hungry. Elemental gun. Need to be using my slow mo more often, really. That guy was scary. Okay, he threw out a lot of poison as well. Fuck off. Look at those cops. Got his fucking finger up my bum. This might be the most golden weapons we've got in an episode so far. Where's the health at? There's the health. We did get an ultra shovel in here, which everyone knows is amazing, but... I'm not going to be that person that just uses Ultra Shovel. I'll never use Ultra Shovel. Beautiful. Oh my god. Oh, no, my game crashed. Okay, that's fair. I mean, I'm hoping, let's let's reboot the game, I'm hoping all of those golden weapons that we got saved. I should have the golden car thrower, I'll know if I have that unlocked. I'm pretty sure that's the golden car thrower. Let's tr let's just find out. <laughs> yes, it is. Okay, so we have a lot of, um, a lot of golden weapons unlocked with this guy. This might be the most we've got as any character so far. We have a lot. Either way, hope you guys did enjoy, that was a lot of fun. I'll see you guys in the next one.